Welcome to Malacca. All right, go for it. So interesting. Yeah, so it's a quail egg, a sausage and sauce. And sauce. <laughs> How is it? Hey, we're Jen and Leon Travel and we are back in Malaysia. We previously spent a month exploring Langkawi and Kuala Lumpur and now we are back in the beautiful city of Malacca. Unfortunately, all of our video footage on the Insta360 which we filmed as a couple and all of the narrative videos are pretty much not here. But we have so many other clips that we want to share with you guys so we hope you enjoy this video that we've put together and definitely you should add it to your Malaysia itinerary. So these bikes are super popular here in Malacca. They're all different themes. <laughs> they light up and play all sorts of music. <laughs> oh, it looks like they're all getting ready to go. <laughs> oh, Pikachu! <laughs> Very fun. So, so cute, right? Eh? <laughs> and they're off. All the buggies. <laughs> so this is the area we are exploring here. <laughs> This is where we were eating Gravy Baby. This is where we were having our food when we first arrived. So we are now on the other side. And that over there is where we saw um, the otters. The streets and the side of the river walk here in Malacca is absolutely incredible. We were totally impressed by all of the artwork and the lights. It was truly, truly a lovely experience and we would highly recommend a visit to this beautiful area. Hey. I'll try one of these. We'll wait 10 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Can we pay for both and just go for a walk and come back to get it? Yeah, it's okay. Okay. okay Thank you. That's how much for both? Uh, so, four and then five for the pork one? Okay, perfect. Okay. Okay. Thank you. 
Yeah. All right, go for it. So interesting. Yeah, so it's a quail egg. Quail egg with uh, sausage inside and sauce. I think they just taste like normal eggs, right? Like chicken eggs? Yeah, but it's nice because like the yolk's kind of soft inside. You've got a bit of sausage in there. Mmm. I want That's five really five. nice. Yeah, that is really nice. I like that. Yeah. Not bad at all. Okay, hold on. <laughs> really well done. It's not very spicy, in my opinion. <laughs> There's a long pause there. Interesting, because I almost just taste, I only taste really egg and chili sauce. Yeah, you don't really get much of the sausage. sausage yeah, 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 I agree. It's nice. Yeah, I like it. Very good. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think it would be nice with a teeny bit of seasoning, like a bit of salt and a little bit of pepper on there. But other than that, I think it's, it's fine. It's great. Not bad as well. Yeah, good, good start. <laughs> Shall so we go and come back, okay? So, what is this? Are you going to candy it? Yeah, cook you it with sugar. With what? With sugar? With sugar? Ah, yeah. oh, okay. So, I'll come back in a few minutes and try one. Okay. All right. I did go back and I did buy some and I had a lovely conversation nice. with the two of them that I was hoping to add in this video but unfortunately I So you cannot. can get shoes and you can get fans and you can get bunny ears and you can get fruit <laughs> oh, and you can get henna tattoos and henna nice I want to get a henna in India in two days excited about that What a beautiful shop. Look inside. How is it? Mm. Mm. For those of you who don't know, I'm a very big chocolate lover and I have seen a chocolate house. Malacca. I love the street art. I really love the street art. That is the famous uh, sort of like kind of red salmon out for some laundry services. So that's what I'm doing. Not really feeling too well today. Bit of a sore throat, but uh, 
so much going on. <laughs> the thing I really love about just like kind of randomly walking around is like you never know what you're gonna find. Just kind of just head around and look. And then, oh, that's something cool. Let's go and have a look at that. <laughs> I like that. Love these like arched walkways. They're so cool. Really handy when it's raining as well, <laughs> which is not now, but it's actually really quite hot at the moment. But so, looking for laundry. So uh, I think there's one like maybe coin operated one maybe a couple of minutes walk from here so I'm just kind of looking for that as you can tell from my voice I'm not really feeling overly well today hello sir hello, hello. okay I've got a little convenience store here turn right and a few convenience stores So I don't think it should be too far from here, but I don't know. Okay, so I tried to use the uh, ATM in the 7-Eleven. Um, for some reason it wasn't taking my card, but I've managed to find uh, this here, the uh, Public Islamic Bank, and uh, there was no problem um, in getting cash out. So if you need to look for an ATM, international cards, the uh, Public uh, public bank or the Islamic bank is just fine. You can see like that the old houses here like they're so like so cool like small with the big shuttered windows all grouped closely together really cool I like it here it's a good crack <laughs> not too bad I think the laundry services are just down here so I don't think I'm too far away now. Hopefully so, because then I can ditch the bag. I'll have some free hands. <laughs> Make life a bit easier. I mean, this looks like a candidate. Oh, here we go. Yep, Adobe. Just over there. Adobe. Laundry services. So, let's go. Looks like there's an attendant as well, which is good. Especially as I don't think I have change either. Okay. One thing you just got to watch is pretty much everywhere there's like random grates and grills and things on the road so just gotta be mindful watch your step okay so here we are Dolby Banda Kaba okay so that's good we have a coin changer so I think we're looking at one token is one ringgit standard wash there looks like six tokens okay let's see if this is gonna have change for a 50 <laughs> let's give it a try uh oh spitting it out that might not be good. Hmm. Okay, so I need to get some change, and I've just come here. I uh, just get a little cake here. Just gotta I'll just get this pork pie. Get some change from this lovely lady. We've got lots of little little cakes here, like wedding cakes and stuff. This is quite cool. Little confectionery. So the laundry place is just over there. So I've just come here to grab the change. <laughs> okay. Thank you. All right, thank you. Uh, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. All right, we are in business. So, if you're going to go for laundry, you need at least a minimum of like a, a maximum, sorry, of like a 20, 20 ringgit note. Because uh, that's all the change machine will take. So anything more than that, if you get a 50, which is what I got from the ATM, uh, then you're not going to be able to get in there <laughs> backwards and forwards but it's okay I don't mind exercise is good okay so we've got six tokens let's just put our so we've got a five and we've got one perfect she gave us a perfect change very happy about that and then we'll put the one in there hmm. that was kind of eager <laughs> spitting it out at least six tokens looking like 23 minutes so I'm now gonna go get some food while that washes and then when I get back I'll pop it in the dryer okay so even though my next stop is to uh, head to Subway for some food I did have to buy this to get some change so let's just give it a try it's like a pork, pork pastry apparently let's try it mm. Mm. see the top there is just quite sweet you can see it's like a sweet and a savory all in one that's not too bad that's actually really good two two ring it 40 uh, two ring it 40 
I'd recommend it. One thing I really love to find and see is like old abandoned buildings. I really don't know why, but I just seem to have this like, just get drawn to them immediately. And I just found this one here. And it's uh, really, really bagged up, but it's been completely bricked off. So I can't really get in there, which is a shame because I would totally have taken you guys in there. It's uh, really cool. Let me flip the camera, I'll show you. So it's quite like a, must have been like a family home or something. It's all like overgrown now and stuff, but it's very, for me, that's very inviting. I'd love to go in there and check it out. But we can't get in there, so we'll continue on our way. Uh, you can just see there, look. Quite a lot of these like abandoned places. Like what's in here? Okay. Hmm. Oh, pretty open. Toilet roll down there if you need it. I am so tempted to go upstairs. Let's do it. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna walk on that. That looks pretty, pretty rough, but. <sighs> there you go. <laughs> I mean, what was the chances? I said I wanted to go inside one, and uh, there you go. Right next door. You gotta watch out for, for these, you know. It's like you. <laughs> not really good for when you're filming because you have to take pay really close attention because you know the, you're either on the road or you're on a very thin pavement and uh you know the cars do come round so it's a lot of a lot of places here that seem to be not derelicts but they look kind of run down but they've got that kind of ancient heritage to them um of course but uh yeah, there seems to be quite a few of those types of places. All right, I'm gonna take this section. But obviously when this place was originally built, you know, it wasn't built for cars, uh, you know, big buses and whatnot. It would have just been horse and carriage rolling through these streets. So it's really difficult, you know, you wanna preserve the heritage of these amazing buildings, but at the same time, you know, it's really hard to then manage with our modern day transportation options and vehicles and things. Got a play field here. Yeah, before I came out, I was uh, contemplating bringing the selfie stick and I didn't bring it. So my my arm is aching just a little bit, but that's okay. You know, I can, I'll pull on through. It's good exercise, I guess. <laughs> Malacca High School, just over there. But you know, it's really nice here. It's very clean, very tidy. You know, there's no litter on the streets, which is, is always a good sign. Um, everything's well maintained, you know, to maintain and protect things as best you can. And it looks like people are definitely doing that. Like I say, very clean, so it's really good. No idea where I am right now. I'm on some sort of back street or something. I don't know what's going on here. But it's okay. <laughs> Again, this is why I love just coming out and just walking around and just trying to find what you can you know never know what you'll find like that building that we just walked into okay so this is what I mean just the pavement stops and now we're on random gutter and grass verge territory <laughs> no <laughs> I really love these they're so cool I think they call them Baba house Baba, Baba houses I don't know I didn't really do a lot of research Okay, where are we going? I'm doing a right very shortly. And that should take me... It's looking like I'm heading more into like a shopping district, which is about right. Because uh, I'm looking for a subway and then a McDonald's. <laughs> which uh, is what we desire today. Whenever I've not been feeling very well, I always tend to go for a subway. It always makes me feel better. I don't know if it's the comfort or it's the food itself. I don't know, but now that's perfect. So I was looking for the McDonald's, which is right here. Perfect. So, and I think the subway is just kind of up and around on the corner. So I'm gonna go and get the subway. 
So then I can turn back around, grab the McDonald's and then head back up that way um, to the laundry. So that's kind of perfect. Um, so I've just had to let my phone call down. I had to turn off the GPS, but pretty sure now what I've got to do is uh, head over to the right here, further down. Oh, maybe we can go in the shopping mall. Ah, oh, okay. Let's go in here. Oh. Oh, that, that aircon is a welcome relief. All right, looks like we've got some sort of wedding going on here. <laughs> or something. Oh, what's happening there? Okay. Oh, look at little bunny rabbits. Oh, <laughs> bee rabbits. <laughs> Those of you who don't know, Jen and I had a uh, had little bunny rabbit in a uh, Netherlands dwarf, dwarf bunny in Canada. Uh, aptly, he was aptly named Bun Bun and he was so cute and we, we loved him and he was a free roaming bunny. We miss him a lot. <laughs> and uh, yeah, always love to see a bunny rabbit. All right, so back outside. So I went into the wrong mall. Um, pretty sure I've got to go to the next one the subway so I'm just heading over there now that's very nice look there's all modern malls and shops here inside there was pretty nice there was a uh, that jewelry place it was like a grand opening going on in there there's KFC Sports Direct which I recognize from England huh, what do we have up here that's pretty cool little garden steps or so I think there's a little garden up there or something. Let's go and have a look. All right. Okay. We get a little hot green here. It's really nice. I love to see these like green spaces in cities. I think it's so important to maintain them. So that's really cool. By the way, it's so so hot. Unbelievable. I think it's like 30. Two or 33 degrees something like that but it's just very like you know, it's very humid I think maybe I've got to head into this one over here <laughs> we shall see I mean there's a Starbucks so we might be on the right path <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure I saw a British flag on that, which is unexpected. Oh, oh wow, there's even more here. Okay. People chilling on the relaxing chairs. A lot of Jollibee ads. Jollibee. Oh, okay, we're definitely getting, I can sense we're getting closer here. Look, we've got restaurants here. Where is it? Where is the subway? <laughs> I cannot find it. Well, there's a Jollibee. No, I don't think we're gonna go in there today. Look what I see. Right behind me, subway. Okay, ready to go. Okay, success, we have the subway. So now, um, one of my pet peeves in Subway is that they do not have sweet corn. Um, and actually, last time in Malaysia they did. So uh, here, unfortunately, they do not. So now I need to find some sweet corn just to finish it off to make it the perfect sub. But I have spotted over here, I've seen a candy house. And I know that Jen will really appreciate it if I go in the candy house and find her some sour candies. So... I am going to do that and uh, see what we can find in there. I don't know, maybe it's pick and mix or something. I'm not too sure, but we'll have a look. The candy house. Let's see. Hmm. Mm, we've got a little bit of everything in here. Sour tape, okay. I think we'll get the sour ones for Jen. 
unless you like those. Okay, so got Jen some sour straps there, which I know she's gonna love. And I found myself some uh, vanilla lemon uh, chocolate flavor cookies, which I know I'll love. So yeah, that was good. It wasn't too bad. It was 17 ringgit. So that's roughly like three pounds or something like that. Not too bad. Well, what is this? <laughs> Some sort of a water feature or water fountain. Okay, so my hunt for sweet corn has led me here. <laughs> I have to say it looks fairly ominous. Like there's just this hole in the wall. I'm literally just walking along. And uh, all right, let's go down and figure it out. I mean, it says family store, so I'm assuming that's a grocery store of some kind. I don't know. What will we find in here? <laughs> It's a very interesting way to get to a grocery store, but, you know, ah, and look, ah, oh, it's a big old store, look at this, oh, it's got a little bit of everything in there, oh, we've got glasses, we've got, got kitchenware and stuff, ah, oh, and we have a grocery centre, perfect, okay, let's find some sweet corn.